I'm in a bit of a rush because I'm getting ready for my first class on a Monday and so I thought I'd do a look today though that is kind of a taupey smoky eye a little bit but still kind of classroom appropriate. So I'm just going to start right away and the first thing I did was I took my shade stick in Street Cool. Any dark dark taupe kind of color will work. And I put it all over the lid, up to the crease. Alright. Now I just kind of patted that in, making sure it is evenly coated, pretty much. Then I took a grease paint stick in French Quarter, which is a dark brown with like a bit of shimmer kind of smoked it out just a little. Not like my usual wing that I do for smoky eyes. So yeah, that's that. And now I'm taking my 213 brush and I'm going to wet it. And I'm taking Satin Taupe Eyeshadow from MAC and putting that in the inner third right over some of the street cool and also towards the middle. So alright, that's everything for eyeshadows. I just kind of whipped through those. You can kind of blend them if you need to. I made sure mine was soft to begin with. So that's the eyeshadows. And I already have two coats of mascara. I put Great Lash Mascara on and then Falsies over top of that one. So there's two coats. And I'm not wearing false lashes today. Mostly I don't have time, but also it is for class, so it's not a huge deal. Now I'm taking Teddy from MAC Eichel and lining my upper and lower water lines. This is actually the first time this class is meeting. It started later in the semester, so I don't want to be late, but yeah, it's been a weird day. And it's a three hour long class, which I'm kind of hoping since today's the first day we won't be there that long. But we might because, you know, there's not that many days that we'll be going. Now I'm taking Avenue Fluid Line from MAC and putting that along the top lash lines. Just a very thin line. More for definition than for like an added drama. You can see this. I'm trying to not totally block it. Then again, it is kind of a basic process. <laughs> Alright, now I'm taking Clinique Bottom Lash in Brown Black. Putting this along my lower lash lines to add some more definition. Okay. And now I'm going to take and do cheeks. I'm using Oso for also Fair Beauty Powder, a really pretty clean pink, and I'm using that with a 129 brush, and I'm going to put that just on my cheekbones, really simple, to add just a little bit of a light color. This is really sheer, don't be afraid about putting too much on of any beauty powder really, I haven't met one yet that has been insane. I guess if it was really pigmented, maybe, or something along those lines. So now I'm taking Dior Amber Diamond, and I'm taking a 109 from MAC, and I'm using that on my cheekbones. Bridge of my nose, just the top bridge part, and Cupid Bow. And then I'm going to take it and put it up here to highlight my brow bone. I'm taking a 224 brush and going to use it just on the inner corner to lighten that up. Oh, kitty. Why do you always do that? 
Alright, well that's cheeks done. So the last thing is only lips. And I'm using Cream Cup from MAC. Just your basic pink. It's in a cream sheen. Which is exactly how it sounds. It comes out more like a cream color. Now I'm using um, Venom from Duop, just a tiny little thing, and it's just a pink. So any shimmery pink gloss will do. And that's the finished look. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Shake a boy! Ooh. Alright, I will talk to you guys later, and I hope you're having a good Monday, since that's what today is. So, bye! Oop. <laughs>